guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl tupo if you're new here welcome 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 please subscribe like comment give me a thumbs up guys today i'm going to show you how to achieve this gorgeous long hair using braiding hair crochet method so if you guys want to see how i achieve this look please continue watching Alright guys, so my hair is freshly washed. I'm going to be using the Cantu Sheer Butter Leave-In Conditioner, you know, just to make sure my hair is nice and moisturized. And I'm also going to be using my Jamaican Black Castor Oil, just to make sure everything is nice and juicy or whatever. You know, shrinkage is real, as you guys can see. Oh my gosh. I'm telling you, this hair can stretch, okay? I'm going to be using my Afro Comb, just to make sure my hair is nice and manageable. And then I'm also going to take my Rat Tail Comb, just to section my hair out. And I'm going to be doing cornrows going all the way to the back nothing serious nothing major just some basic basic cornrows going all the way to the back and you know i gotta use some clips just to make sure i'm holding the hair out of the way because you know my hair is short and it is thick sis oh my gosh this hair is thick sis there this hair sour here is so easy you can do this in an hour and you are done so I'm gonna do the rest of the braids and then I'm going to be using some more of the Jamaican black castor oil and the coconut oil mixture, you know, just to make sure everything is nice and moisturized. My hair is nice and juiced up. You already know when I'm trying to do a protective style, it is good to always have your hair nice and moisturized. And then I'm just gonna massage this scalp, guys, and that's about it, okay. So I'm going to be using this I Define Easy Braid, guys. This is just the basic braiding hair. It comes three in a pack. I wanted to show you guys that you can actually use braiding hair to have like a natural blowout kind of look or situation going on okay so i'm going to cut the ends a little bit and then i will feather the hair but if you want it like this long you can actually go for it okay sis i wanted it to be a little bit shorter that's why i am cutting this hair right here but if you have short hair you know short pre straight hair you can actually use that i'm just gonna brush it you know just to make sure it looks nice and realistic like it has that little tail to it <laughs> So I'm gonna be using this basic crochet needle. So, you know, opening and closing it just exactly the way I'm doing, okay? Sectioning the hair, I'm actually taking a little piece at a time, guys. I wanted to use exactly one pack of this braiding hair. I'm just gonna place the crochet needle in, open the hook, take the braiding hair, place it on the hook, and then close it, pull it out, okay? I'm going to be using my fingers to pull the hair in. So once I place the hair in, both strands in, I'm just gonna give my hand a little twist, and then I'm going to place it in again, and then just pull it out. Exactly the way I'm saying, you wanna tie it twice, that way it is really nice and secure. Cause you don't wanna be combing the hair out, and then, you know, just hair falling all over the place. We wanna be nice and secure. <laughs> So I just want you guys to stick around and see how I did the top part right there where I'm gonna have the section. But otherwise, the other parts, I'm just gonna do the basic, basic crochet method. So I'm gonna show you guys again, place the crochet needle in, open the hook, place the braiding hair on the hook, close the hook and then pull it out, okay? So once you pull it out, you're gonna take both strands. I'm going to be using my fingers to pull the hair in and then I'm going to give my hand a little twist. That way, you know, it's nice and locked. And then I'm going to place the hair in again and pull it out. Exactly the way I'm saying, guys, oh my gosh, this right here is so, so easy. It took me an hour to do this style right here. I'm telling you, I'm trying to give you styles that are easy, cute, but also saving you time, money, and everything. I'm in 2022, we coming for you. We saving money. Okay, anyway, while we're still talking, sis, have you subscribed to my channel? Don't forget to turn on your notification button so you do not miss out on any uploads because this channel is getting what? Juicy! Yes, sis! Place the braiding hair on the hook, close the hook, and then pull it out, okay? And then you're just gonna take your braiding hair, placing it in, and then you're just gonna place it in again and pull it out. Anyway, so I wanted to show you guys how I got the part. So I like to do my middle part and my side part. So what you're gonna do is you're going to place the crochet needle in, okay, exactly the same way. And then you're going to take your braiding hair, placing it on the hook, close the hook and pull it out. So once you pull it out, guys, you're gonna take one of the strands and place it in exactly the way I'm doing and then just pull it out. And this time you're just gonna tie it once, very, very easy. So once you do that, when you flip the hair, you're gonna have a really nice parting to the hair, okay? style 
looks like you got your natural hair straightened out sis i mean this looks really really nice and legit and nice and full we are out here trying to look cute or whatever very very easy beginner friendly anybody can actually do this Today's shout out goes to Amy's episode. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right, sis. Thank you so much for supporting my channel. Thank you for rocking with me. Thank you for all the love. I really, really appreciate it. You are a real one today. Okay, sis. Anyway, so I'm gonna show you guys again the little method that I'm doing. So what you're gonna do is you're going to place the crochet needle in, okay? And then you're going to take your braiding hair, placing it on the hook, close the hook and pull it out. So once you pull it out, guys, you're gonna take one of the strands and place it in exactly the way I'm doing and then just pull it out. And this time you're just gonna tie it once. So the whole point is when you flip the hair, you know, wherever you wanna, you wanna have the part, it looks really nice and neat. It looks like it is growing out of your scalp. I hope y'all gonna be rocking this hairstyle because this is easy and no leave out. How about that, sis? You're gonna be looking cute with some braiding hair, doing it in a crochet method and actually looking like, you know, your hair grew overnight. Your natural hair is nice and stretched out or something like that. Once I'm done, you know, I'm just gonna take my kiss edge fixer and make sure I lay these baby hairs, honey. We better lay these baby hairs, all right? I'm gonna be using my mousse just to make sure, you know I don't have any flyaways, everything is nice and settled, everything looks really nice and lit, lit. Since you can take a brush, you can take a comb and brush the hair all the way down. And baby, when I tell you this hairstyle came all the way through, Sis, I am living for this natural hair blowout situation. Okay. This looks like Miss Tupa One went to sleep yesterday and woke up with some long hair, don't care, full hair, or whatever you want to call it. I am loving this. Let me know if you guys are feeling this hair right here. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying it because this is easy. You know me, I gotta throw in a few styles here and there. I am feeling the thickness of this hair, you know, big hair, don't care. You already know I love some big hair, don't care, honey. And baby, the styles are coming all the way through as well. And you know, I cannot be accessorizing queen without adding some accessories. Once I get this twisted situation going on, I'm just gonna take this to the bag and, you know, add an accessory. <laughs> Let me know if you guys are feeling it. Let me know if you guys are going to be trying it. And you know, I gotta throw it to the back as well. And I gotta give you a little bun situation, honey. Yes, Miss Tupu. Let me know which one was your favorite style. Let me know if you guys are gonna be trying all of them. I want y'all to try all these styles. And make sure you're tagging me on Instagram at Tupo One once you try these hairstyles, cause you know what? I'ma be reposting everything. And I'm actually feeling these styles right here. And let me tell you, this hairstyle is nice and versatile. You can actually rock a middle part as well. When I tell you it looks really nice and realistic on the top right here, this is an hour hairstyle and you are done. I believe how cute this hairstyle turned out. I am loving this braiding hair situation going on. I mean, we're about to save money, time, and everything in 2022, honey, 2022, because listen, we're already done with 2021, but listen, you can actually rock this on Christmas Eve. You can rock this on Christmas Day while opening those presents. <laughs> Thank you guys so so much for watching my videos thank you for subscribing thank you for liking i cannot believe we are here today you guys are making a girl's dreams come all the way through make sure you share this with your cousin your bestie your mama and your aunt because sharing is caring and i will catch you guys in my next one bye